Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Pravin Kumar Bomisetti. In this video, we'll cover how to set up the snow SQL, that is CLI, command line interface, okay, see? So before that, you should understand, so Snowflake can be logged with the help of Snow Site UI, Classic Console, and Snow SQL CLI. First two are user interface. Snow SQL is the CLI, command line interface. So this requires some setup required for this one, okay? So syntax that what? So see, Snow SQL, hyphen A, Accord name, hyphen you, username. So see, if you want to log to Snow SQL, so by using Snow SQL, hyphen A, Accord name, hyphen you, username. Okay, see, let us discuss. Okay, we'll do the installation so, of CLA. Okay, one second, give me. Okay, this is the Snow site you say user interface. Okay, for Snow SQL download, now what happens? So see, search for Snow SQL download. Okay, see Snow SQL download. Click on this volume. Okay, see. Okay, scroll down. So see if you're using Linux machine. Okay, see Mac OS, Windows. So mostly use Windows. So see if you are using okay Windows, click on this Snow SQL for Windows. Okay, it will be download. So it will be download will be there. Okay, once download complete, click on this volume. So it's done. So once done, we can able to open the same thing. Okay, click for next. So nothing no need to do, simple click next, next and install. Okay, up to the admin permission. So it's given what? Complete the Snowflake Snow SQL setup wizard. Snow SQL hyphen a account name hyphen you login name. Okay, login username. See how can you log in? See, see what happened. So it can be logged in. So see, so finish. Okay, search for, search for CMD, command from command. So what is the, what we should use? So what is syntax? Snow SQL hyphen A, and we should get the accord name. How to get the accord name? Go to Snowflake. So click on this well, so see. So one second, so see. In the Snow site, you click username, okay, account, and click on this account, so this, Copy account URL one more time. How to get so click on this okay account name. So click on the account. So navigate. So see navigate like this. Navigate. So see what I should copy the copy account URL. So control V. So control V. Now we don't want all things. So see from remove this value. And we don't want snowflake computing. So we want to extract from here to here. So this is the account. Okay, this is what account name so control okay see right click snow sql hyphen a account name hyphen a username how to get my username that is select current user current user okay see control enter my username is dbt prevent so copy the same value so right click so space right click snow sql hyphen a the username hyphen you and okay hyphen you Username. Now, what happened? Password will be get. Now, remember one thing. So, here password, we can't able to see the password. Now, which password I should give here? Tell me. So, which password I should give? We should give the snow, snow site UI password. Snow site UI, our classic console UI password. So, this is the username of snow site and the username, the password of the snow site. So, it's a password cannot be visible. That was the main point. Okay. So, and it's a case sensitive. Okay, now what happened now? See, go back here. So, Paul, see, I want to use this database. How to get this database? Use database. So, Pravin DBT. Same thing. Use schema. So, Pravin SC. Okay, like this way, you can able to get got the point. See, okay, this is the username, virtual warehouse. So, this is the database name. This is my schema name. So, one more time, how to get, okay, so Snow SQL. First, to download Snow SQL from the Google. Chrome. Okay. Next one is that what open command prompt. Okay. Command prompt. Now, what's the command you should use? No SQL. One more time so that we can close. No SQL hyphen a account name. Okay. Hyphen you username. Okay. How to get the account name? So, see, click on this value. Okay. See, click on the same thing. So, click and copy the account URL. Okay. Account URL. See. So, paste here. And we don't want all things. I remove this value, okay. I remove this computing dot. We don't want same thing. And how to get the username? Select the current user. Control enter the shortcut key. Now copy the so copy the same thing. And where I should execute in the where I should execute in the command prompt. So that what we can able to get. We should give the user ID. This is a username. 
and the password of this snow site where so that we can able to log in so right now what so snow sql has been logging that okay see this is my database this is my schema same thing show table this is all the normal thing okay. so got the point of this query this is okay so this is the way you can able to log into snow sql if you like the content subscribe and share the channel thank you for watching